Good morning, Z Nation. This is Daily Xana number 122 coming at you all sweaty in the early to late or late morning right now. Around 11.30 in the afternoon. I mean, late morning. Jeez. Come on, get it together. Um, I just got back uh, doing a four-mile run with a friend. We did some interval running in between those miles. So breaking up into 45 increments of work, hard sprints, and 45 seconds of rest, and then 30, and so forth. So we did about six of those in be in between the four miles total so it's a good running workout that's for sure right now we are just at jimmy hula's a uh, burger place to get some food and uh, i'm just waiting on my food right now he's still ordering and i'm just enjoying the sunshine so uh good day to start good way to start the morning so far and uh looking forward to later on going to a uh, another barbecue again with uh co-workers and uh, having some ribs there so definitely a uh Foodie day. What is good, Z Nation? Back to today's number one, two, two. Not much filming going on today, but a busy day nonetheless. Started out with me going for a four mile run with my friend, which we did intervals in between after mile one. So between mile two and three for the most part, we were doing intervals of 45 seconds on, 45 seconds off at about 550 pace on those 45 seconds on, and then 45 seconds was just going to be a jog, and then going down to 30 seconds from there. So good, good time there. Fun in the sun, caught up with him business-wise, and then from there to a uh, burger place to grab some food, and then later on around 3, 3.30, uh, got picked up by a co-worker, we went to another co-worker's uh, kind of get-together barbecue thing, and that was cool, she, uh, co-worker's family lives on a lake, so we were able to go to a boat and stuff, so that was cool, I went mini-golfing afterwards, and right now it's 10.30, so I'm going to hit the hay early and wake up early and uh, write a couple workouts out and then start my day so that's what i got going on stay productive let's stay focused let's stay on task here and listening to an interesting podcast with uh um interesting podcast for joe rogan experience episode 911 of uh, joe rogan interviewing mr alex jones the man who does info wars and also on the uh, podcast was Eddie Bravo, and uh, definitely interesting to hear stuff they talk about that the normal mainstream media, which is pretty much going away uh, because the audience just isn't there. And anytime you're in the business um, to make money and you're in media, well, they're kind of, <laughs> you're going to come across uh, certain news pieces you put out they're gonna give you the most money aka advertising or donors but then that money's gonna lend its way to kind of controlling what you put out so you gotta be always cautious and just understand and have a good mindset and perspective as far as where you're actually getting your news information from and what it really comes down to is just doing your due diligence due diligence and research for me I don't really do much of that so I've never never really converse in a lot of news topics just because I know I haven't done my due diligence in my research and I know I'm not just gonna say what I've mainly heard from others because for the most part it's generally going to be combined with different past opinions different experiences that per individual person has had uh, to tie into certain topics and such so I try to uh, at the moment focus my energy towards other things and that's a continual habit I am uh, trying to build upon I'm not saying it's great by any means you continue to build up on that and uh, just develop, develop strict, uh, strict and productive and positive habits that will uh, continually lead to the goal, the goals that I put forth. And I, I just want to be uh, ultimately different and higher up than a lot of other, other people and uh, really uh, make something the life that I have and uh, that's what I want to do there's times though uh, go slow but hey 
as long as I enjoy the process. It helps, that's for sure. Hair is needed of a haircut. Not sure when I'll get a haircut, but I will definitely have a haircut by the time I see Mr. Pena. This portion right here has been giving me trouble for the past week. It just doesn't ever want to stay over completely, although it's kind of getting there eventually. Um, yeah. Got my sun today, got my handstands in. I'm not really sure what I'm doing anymore with working out. <laughs> as far as following much of a regimen, I just can't. I'll, I'll, I'll do bathroom next, but I don't stick to it too, too strict at the moment, I guess. I'm more just in a different phase right now, as long as I'm working out or just staying active. Um, that's good enough by me. But, uh, yeah. That's all I can really report right now. Daily Zen number 122 in the books. Pleasure as always. Peace, love, unity, and respect. Cut you in the next installment. This has been the nightly Daily Xander recall of the day. So hope you enjoyed. Catch you in the next installment. As always, keep it classy. Keep it pithy. Keep staying productive. Keep staying positive. Keep saying your affirmations day in, day out. And as always, smile. <laughs> Peace.